What's up guys here it is Kanhan Dubai back again with another video and in today's video we'll be talking about another quick fix uh, and uh, that quick fix will be regarding the error which is being thrown while trying to upgrade the flutter SDK so basically uh, you can see right now in my laptop I mean, command prompt window is opened up right here and in the command prompt window you can see that while trying to execute the flutter upgrade command I had this error being thrown up again and again and again and this kind of uh, just keeps going on and on and on and it doesn't get resolved automatically obviously so uh, a pretty easy workaround which I found out was now depending on your choice like on internet you will see that there are uh, suggestions or advices that you should just close or end the dart.sd sorry dart.exe uh, process to the task manager or just go into the uh, you know handles and just search into the cpu in uh, resource monitor that too through task manager itself and from there you should just close whichever process is using the folder but that was all a little bit uh, you know uh, confusing for me uh, personally so uh, I did a rather simple thing and it worked out for me so I hope that it might work out for you too so the thing is that I was trying to uh, execute the flutter upgrade command from the VS code itself and I was not able to do so at that time also this error was popping up uh, or being thrown again and again so uh, I tried opening a new command prompt window and I, I opened it without any administrative privileges it didn't happen so I thought it's something related to administrative privileges then I open another command from window as you can see right here with administrative privileges and then I executed flutter upgrade command but still it didn't work out as you can see I tried uh, and it failed two times then I, I stopped the uh, process or uh, what they call bad jobs and uh, after that I again tried executing it but it still didn't work here as you can see in this section and after this what I figured out was that if you're suggesting you know if the people uh, over Stack Overflow or other websites are suggesting us to stop all the processes which we might be using this, uh, you know, folder Dart uh, SDK's folder, which is causing conflict. Then why not we just uh, close that IDE from the background because that's the only known software which is using Dart SDK in my understanding. So I just simply uh, close the VS Code IDE, which uh, according to my understanding, uh, stopped the Dart or Dart .exe, Dart Dart .exe process from the background and terminated it and that just freed you know the dart uh, process and because of that now the sdk folder was not being used by dart.exe or any other process which might be involved in doing so and so after that when i came here and ran uh, the or i should say executed the flutter upgrade command then uh, the execution was successful and the zip was downloaded the dart sdk was downloaded and uh, it was unzipped and you know the normal procedure which happens usually uh, happened without any problems without any issues although the log is might much shorter than previous uh, you know processes when we used to upgrade flutter sdk but yeah so uh, you can see that i was able to successfully install it so uh, yeah that's it guys uh, the workaround was simply this that you just need to close the id I was telling you all this in the video so that you can just prevent doing all this stuff and go for the simple alternative first try it out if it that doesn't work then you can go for more complex ways like looking into the you know more specific processes which might be used in the folder and all that stuff right which is coming on the internet many times solutions are much more simpler than we think they should be and uh, we keep uh, stumbling across uh, different types of solutions available on the internet that's why i just first you know clarified that whatever i tried and whatever haven't worked for me and whatever did work for me that's guys i hope you like the video and if you like the video then hit the like button below and do subscribe to the channel for more of these sort of videos and also hit the notification bell icon button uh, beside the subscribe button if you subscribe to the channel for keeping yourself updated with the latest uploads which i do on this channel and also comment in the comment section below if you have big doubts regarding this video itself or any other video in the past which i have uploaded and that's it guys i will see you in the next video until then goodbye